An East Bay community is remembering a winery owner killed in a crash last Friday. Our Crown Forest Teresa Estacio spoke with a winemaker and friend who says Mitchell Katz will be greatly missed by many. He was just bigger than life. He was an awesome guy. Rhonda Wood is the owner and winemaker at Wood Family Vineyards in Livermore, located less than a mile from the Mitchell Katz Winery. She says everyone who knew Mitchell Katz is heartbroken about his sudden death. Livermore police said that Katz was driving this white SUV truck when it collided with a black Subaru on East Avenue Friday afternoon. Katz was taken to the hospital but died. Authorities say that the driver of the black SUV is cooperating and toxicology tests are being conducted in the ongoing investigation. He worked hard. He worked very hard for what he had and he finally got what he wanted. You know, he had his own place, um, his own winery instead of like just uh, leasing land. He, Mitch was incredibly proud of both his boys. On the winery's Facebook page, a posted message addressed Kat's death, adding, quote, as expected, we, his family and extended family are all devastated and saddened by this tragedy, end quote. Sons uh, Jackson works for another winery, and uh, he was so proud of him. And his other son is a firefighter in the foothills. And, you know, he talked about, you know, we all talk about what we might do, right? And he talked about getting a home, you know, a second home or a third home near near Wesley in the foothills and, and spending, you know, half of his time there, some of his time off there with with the family there. Wood says that she skied with cats recently as they both shared a love of Tahoe and wine. You know, when you make wine, you see them happy. And I think that's what he liked to do. He liked to come out and talk with them and tell his stories. And, you know, he liked to... Yeah, you know, he make people feel good. She says cats will be remembered fondly by many in the Livermore Valley wine industry and much more. And the fact that he worked so hard his whole life to get to where he is right now, where he was right now, you know, um, that, that anybody can do if you work hard enough what he did. In Livermore, Teresa Estacio, Cronfor News.